This thing is so floppy, even Bluetooth wouldn't help. So let's fix that. I used to have my AMS units mounted to the wall, but we recently moved to a new house and now there is a closet door behind my printers. In a spark of absolute genius, I built this frame with some plywood and mounted it to the bench. However, my big wet brain decided to completely forget about the fact that the plywood is in fact flexible. I didn't have any 2x4s on hand, so once again I had to use my printers to fix the problem that exists only because I have those printers. It seems to be a common thing for me now. After some research, I ended up printing the AMS stacking system by Jaxel. It was fairly fast to print, easy to assemble with everything snapping together, and most importantly, it allows for the bottom AMS lid to be opened without having to slide it out or taking the top AMS off. I used PLA Plus because it prints faster and cleaner than PETG and it is more than strong enough for this project. The cool thing about this design is that it uses the AMS itself as a brace and support, so once you put everything together it is very sturdy and stable. I did use a bit of CA glue on the dowels and the feet but it is optional and I wish I haven't done that, because the whole thing is actually wider than the printer. So once again I had to use the printers to fix that problem, so I found another design, but the problem is that my top vent is actually wider than just a regular printer, so I had to adjust the whole model slightly. After printing it I just glued everything together and now the whole stack is safe to use.